Major fracture detected. What, Eva? What do you hear? Hi, everybody! What's going on? What's up, Manic? What's up, Toast and Eva and Fury Fighter? Bacon, Depressed Cat? Hi, everybody! Happy Friday! I hope you're doing well. Ah, <laughs> I'm doing good. I'm doing good now that it is Friday and the work week is over and I'm here. The wonderful silence for a while. It is not to last here. It is simply not to last, I'm afraid. Oh, God. I don't know. I don't know. Like, my... I, I don't, like, hate my work or anything. I like my company. I like my coworkers. I, I like the stuff that I do, but... I don't know. These days, it's just... It's just... It's just... It's just... It's just chat. It's just... It's just... Uh. I'm so tired by the end of the week, and it's just stuff, Tedi tedious, draining. I wanna, I just, I just wanna play video games, chat. That's why I'm, that's why I'm so happy when I, when I show up here every night. It's like this is what I want. I, this is what I want to do. I just wanna play video games. It's very simple. I wanna wake up and I wanna play video games and I wanna go to bed. It's, it's a simple cycle. Take a six-month break from your job and work at McDonald's for a bit. Relearn to appreciate how well you have. It. Yeah, yeah, that would that would do it, won't it? Are you glad you then get to come back to people that respect you and treat you with kindness and charity? Who? <laughs> who? Who are we talking about? Are you are you are you sure you're in the right place, Eva? Now dance, monkey, dance. Dance for us! <laughs> Look, chat. Look, chat. I have to take a mandated swig of water, okay? Now we can talk about how good I have it. Yeah, other people, clearly. <laughs> but yes, I'm good. I'm good. It was, it was a good week. It's been a good week. And we're gonna have, um... Honestly, we're gonna, we're gonna have a fairly busy weekend, too. Uh, all, you know, we don't, we do all our stuff on Saturday. My kids have a bunch of classes and activities and stuff. Uh, and then on Sunday, we're having a big old thing here. All, like, all of our friends are coming over and we're gonna do pumpkin carving. We're gonna do pumpkin carving and pizza making. Uh, and that's gonna be an all day affair. That's gonna be super fun, but, you know, party here. <clears throat> About to have another new brand of frozen pizza here, Polanmo. I don't think I've heard of that one. Well, definitely keep us informed how it is, Fury. <laughs> What's up, Spice? Dance for me, monkey of the blue light. That almost sounds charming. That almost sounds nice. I'll trade you out as you can come work where I am and I'll do what you do. Oh, because, yeah, you, you made it sound like such such a great experience. <laughs> you've, really, you've really sold that job to me, Manic. I'm positively intrigued at watching a certain voice actress torch their career even more. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's been a thing, hasn't it? It's... I mean, if, if, if it weren't for Elon Musk buying Twitter, I would, like, I would say she is, she is the queen of dig up stupid at the moment, but we all know how that's going to go. But yeah, man, I guess... I guess ultimately Platinum Games kind of dodged a bullet here then, in a way. It's the whole internet that is wrong. Literally, literally her tay. Well, yeah. I mean, it's... Considering the content of the internet, it's not... Taken, taken on its own, that's not the worst take of the world. But when you apply it to her bullshit, yeah. yeah. A lot of stupidly digging up this week for sure. Yep. Yep. What do y'all think about Twitter? 
Are y'all gonna, are y'all, well, I imagine a bunch of you aren't even on Twitter, uh, which is the correct move. Congratulations. Uh, you're way ahead of the rest of us. Um, those of you that are morons like me, are you gonna, are you gonna stick around? Are you gonna, are you gonna keep hanging out on the benighted bird site? Twitter is a trash fire. Twitter was born a trash fire. Twitter was always destined to be a trash fire. You want to watch it burn? I think, I think that's a very fair opinion. I have a weird question. Would you take a bad dragon sponsorship? Bad dragon. What is bad dragon? I feel like I should know what this is. Might get one though, literally, because Jobs might be looking for me. <laughs> I think on it, okay, straight up. I think the best thing about that, I think the best thing about that whole interaction was Toast just being like dildos. And then like a split second later, Manic being like, Oddish, no! <laughs> like, <laughs> heroically diving in front of the dildos to save me. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Oh my Jesus. Okay. Um, so yeah, probably not. No. Uh, <laughs> doesn't mean he has to show them on stream. I'm well. Now you've got me curious. Now I'm I'm wondering what what would what would a bad dragon sponsorship constitute? I mean, would would it re what would that require? Uh, personal testimonials. Um. <laughs> Heroically diving in front of the dildos to save me. You came at the right time, Alceris. No pun intended. <laughs> Drinking that tea at midnight may have been a bad decision. Oh, well, tomorrow's Saturday. It's fine, Toast. You'll be fine. Dildo bad out of Saints Row. <laughs> Twitter as is, let libs of TikTok stick around so I think Musk can do what he wants. Can't get that much work. Oh, it definitely can. It definitely can. Twitter, believe it or not, Twitter did have some standards. Poorly enforced standards, mind you. Um, very spottily enforced standards. But I mean, there were there were plenty of like subhuman bottom feeders that I have reported and they ended up banned. And I think there's every reason to believe that may not be the case going forward. Came at the right time. Parasite Eve is over. Let it go. <laughs> I like. I imagine they're going to be unbanning a lot of people. I could. I could totally see Musk just being like, "Yeah, we're not banning people anymore." At least at first. I posted an article from The Verge uh, in Discord a little bit uh, a little while ago that I think is a really really good take on it, um, which is that no person in their right mind would actually want to manage Twitter and this fucking idiot just spent $44 billion to take that upon himself. And he's about to learn some really hard lessons really fast, assuming he's not too like knuckle dragging stupid to learn them. <clears throat> I like Twitter for the art references to get uploaded there. Felt like the rules anyway if you're popular enough. You cannot say these things unless you get us clicks. Yeah. He is though, yeah, that's the thing. That's the thing. You really, you really can't. <laughs> I don't think it's possible to assume the worst about Musk. I think he will always find a way to surprise you. Yeah, that's probably accurate, Manic. That is probably accurate. We'll see. I'm not so. Look, I've been I've been on Twitter for years now, just chugging along with my little gold-plated games account. 
I actually have another account on on Twitter that I used briefly like many many years ago that I've almost completely forgotten about but I mean I don't I don't have a commanding Twitter following. I don't know if anyone that shows up to these streams is actually is actually shepherded here by my tweets. Um so if if things get really gross and ugly like Facebook did, I got no problem just shutting that shit down. I think it, as as I get older and I get more comfortable with streaming, I get less less and less interested in running anything any kind of social media like outside of this. I'm like, okay. If they're not <laughs> If they're not here yet, like how much can I do to get them to come here? Fine. I got who I want. We're good. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah don't expect to ever see me on the tiktok <laughs> i have one of my coworkers. yeah <laughs> so we're, we're on the same page but like different sides of it spice clearly you should tiktok i should not tiktok i absolutely should tiktok tiktok takes effort TikTok takes a lot of effort. My my life is not so exciting that I can just like record shit on the fly and upload it and be a TikTok star. <clears throat> Make a fake audition account and upload him demoing that game. Don't do that. <laughs> yeah. I want to stream. That's what I want to do. That's it. Um my 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 interests in in content creating and the like have definitely have definitely narrowed down. <clears throat> Your bullshit uploads take three hours. Yeah. Now this is this right here, chat is about all I can manage. Stumble in here at nine p.m. every night, play some game badly, get ridiculed, shunt it onto YouTube with absolutely no editing whatsoever. Yeah, that's that's what you get. That is that that is the 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 bespoke GPG experience. That's what all y'all signed up for. <laughs> and uploads it three times sometimes. Yeah, sometimes you get triple the content. <laughs> Sk <laughs> yes, skill. That is the skill that y'all have come to expect from a GPG stream. I wouldn't have it any other way. Mmm. -mm. Good stuff. All right. Well, speaking of good stuff, let's play some Yomori, shall we? Let's let's get let's get back to the spooking in. I was greatly enjoying this last night, uh, and we're also we're also uh, right up to about where I stopped playing before. I think so. All of this stuff that we that we did last night. I, I had some dim recollections of it. Obviously, I didn't remember all the jump scares because Jesus Christ. I got jump scared like half a dozen times last night. And it was great. Um, so tonight, we should definitely be hitting stuff that I'm not at all familiar with. I've never seen before. Oddish, I beat NES Batman and D gold-plated games. I have my... Look. <laughs> I see you there, Cragger. I have my moments. There is... There are a couple things that I can do well, and the other stuff just kind of fills in the gaps around it. So. You know. Swing. So I think we're jumping back into Yui. Yeah, we're jumping back into Yui's shoes. She's in like the junkyard or something. I was gonna be so giddy next Friday. I don't understand. I don't understand a lot of things, kid. I'm almost 40 years old. Oh, thir yeah, Thursday and Saturday. Oh my God, I can't wait for the power hours to come back. I, I, look, I have thoroughly enjoyed everything we've done. I've thoroughly enjoyed most of what we've done this month. I'm glad we did it. I'm, I'm glad we did a, a proper spooktober month. I'm glad we're closing it out strong. But oh my god, I missed the power hours before we even started. And I will be so happy to be back in the loving embrace of Nintendo Power. You ever regret those words when you have to deal with Dingus and Doofus again? Hey, we're past 
we're past the halfway point with them, aren't we? We finished June, right? We're, we're into the back half now? I see the light at the end of the tunnel. What is going on? Find the road to go home. Plus, we're coming up on some we're coming up on some really cool stuff. We're definitely coming up on some stuff that I've been wanting to do for a while. Soul Blazer is somewhere in the next few issues, and I'm really excited for that. Enjoying listening to a fairly decent VA cast and their growing pains and Wendy and Wendy Lee. I actually showed the D stream to a friend. He's been saying to me that this is bad, and I regret the time we spent on it. Clip in response to things. Yay! I'm so happy. <laughs> oh, that was a woman. Don't no! Don't forget about power hours. Power hours. It. Oh my god. Okay. Um. Don't do this in real life, unless you're Indiana Jones and you're about to be nuked. Don't do this. <laughs> Everybody. This is, this is where everybody's chat. Everybody's mind went to the same place. Prefer Illusion of Time, but Soul Player Blazer is a fantastic start. But I mean, that's the thing. Once we do Soul Blazer, like, I'm definitely want, gonna want to do the rest of the games in that series. I mean, Mrs. Wendy Lee appearing in every dub, no matter if it fit or not. Ah. Okay, bye. What? What's this? What's what? In that era, she was in everything. Yeah. Spirit isn't going to attack me? Terra Enigma. Right, right, Toast? <laughs> they usually come right at me and try to catch me, but why aren't they now? Well, at this point, at this point, I'm not afraid to try anything. I will, I will try just about any game that that come comes across our plate, because I ain't gotta finish it. <laughs> Wish I could stream my Switch next week. Want to show this game, even though it won't show up? Huh? I can't open this fence. It's up, low or high? Does hold up Silva's the most RPG of the games? Ultra Kaiju Monster Rancher. I started the first English tournament of it in uh, Discord. Nice. I know you've been very excited about that. It sounds like an awesome concept, too. I love the sound of it. Doggo! Chaco? Chaco, what are you doing here? Whee! Arf! Orf! Are you looking for me? Orf! Thank you. Chaco is super cute. Chaco, I have to go home. Mom is probably worrying about me. Ah! Orf. Wait, don't go that way. Where are you going? We don't deserve doggos, it's true. Wow, okay. Nothing actually bad happened to her that time. Some chakras are brutally murdered. Okay, did I get... Fireflies live longer. I don't think I even have any fireflies yet. Did you check out Burgers and Frights? No, I didn't. I went to bed right after the stream last night, and then I was pretty busy today. I've had so many meetings this week. 
with other editors and, and folks and yeah i i will i i will check it out this weekend i'll have some time to, to dink around uh if every time i get a free moment now i've been playing marvel snap i really like that game i've been having a great time with that um I wanted to check out that uh, horror-y-looking Mario thing that uh, that Bacon posted. That looked pretty neat. Okay, I don't see anything that looks like a garbage dump here. Um, it might just be the woods. So I think... I'm going to head east out of here and see what happens. <laughs> Need to finish my game of Little Nightmares so I can move on to... Yes, you do. I love both of those games. I think they are great. Glad it's not a gotcha... Hi. Hello? Good? That was the, that was the girl that got ghost hit by the train. Used posters ripped up and thrown away. Who would do this? Yeah, I I love I'm like I'm I'm very happy that Marvel Snap is not like just a, a nasty old cash grab. He took my rock. Like it's really straightforward, it's really fun, and it doesn't want to siphon all of the money out of me. Oh, nuts. I'm going the wrong way. Made a ton of progress on Yakuza 3. I'm on, like, chapter 9 out of 12. Nice. Bandai trademark what looks like a client from the new Digimon card game. Gladly try that. I'm definitely getting... I think between between the, the pending One Piece card game and Marvel Snap, I'm definitely, like in the mood for card games right now. I'm kind of keeping an eye out for other stuff that I might want to might want to give a try. Oh, cash back. <laughs> whoa, 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 who's who, what, where? Oh, fuck me. Paper card games, I think I'm all into flesh and blood. Uh, if they even play at your uh, local game store. Yeah, I think as, as far as paper games go, I'm definitely I'm I'm definitely focused on the One Piece card game. I definitely want to do that one. So it's it's digital ones that I'm looking into at the moment. So I will certainly field suggestions if y'all have them. So. Anything down here? Oh. Sorry, what? Maybe this is where we're going? Jesus, kid. Oh, I hate. Okay. Looks looks like we got the ghost fields again. God, I rem I remember this sequence in uh, in Night Alone, and how much it freaked me out. And <laughs> that's a butt. Have a dog. Have a rock. What was I? What was I trying to say? Have a duck. <clears throat> Miss Wow raid decks for the CCG. Push, right? Yeah, push. Hmm. 
Why am I? Oh, oh, hey, hi. Hello. Why am I hearing the train out here? Like, like I, I kind of have to wonder if like a, tr a commuter train is just gonna come like speeding out of the fields all of a sudden and fucking flatten me. Seems like I took the direct approach. Oh good, a graveyard. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. I think I got a garbage bag? What the hell did I just get? Um, I got a, what was that? Small candle, small candle. It looks like it will get used up fast. I should be careful with it. Oh, this is Will of the Wisps? I think so, something like that. Trash bag, a black trash bag thrown away on the street. It's really dark when you put it over your head. Okay, but like, why? Ball of mud found. A little ball of mud is so shiny and round and polished that you wouldn't even think it's made out of mud. Portable hiding spot, okay. And not like portable suffocation spot. Okay, I don't like tire tracks. I don't like tire tracks. Where the hell am I? Down in the fields. Oh, Christ, okay. Danger up ahead. It's too dangerous, don't go until I say. Pizza smelling really good. Not yet. They're close. They're gone. Oh my God. I told you not to go out until I told you it was safe. Well, shit. That was good. That was a good one. More days. More days. <laughs> when a dog is kind of cute, he is, isn't he? It's an old sign in huge letters that says illegal dumping is prohibited. No dumping on me, chat. Poor dogs are gonna break their ghost teeth. Ah, okay. Just as well then. I missed this Jizo earlier. Now where is Yui? Seem seems to be out in the out in the woods somewhere, Mr. Alien. I think she might actually, oh yeah, I think she's actually this way. I think we were going the wrong way. 
Okay, this is kind of fucked up. Because there's this, th there's this ghost guy that I can only see with... There's the ghost that I can only see with my flashlight, and then there's the pot that only comes after you if you're using your flashlight. Shit. There we go. Doggo wasn't trying to eat us, I would like it more. I agree, Sailor P. Oh, shit. Okay. A loud noise out there. Nope, 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 nope. That is a dancing knife. I told you I don't like tire tracks. Just glad the death scenes of the game aren't over animated. Yeah, they are. I, I think them to be exactly as long as they need to be. I say I really like the season mechanic in Endless Legend. There's summer, good, and winter, terrible, and over time winters get longer after a certain turn. Summer never comes back? Wow. Damn. Empty box found. An empty bo uh, robot toy box. It seems like uh, five machines combined to form the robot. There's nothing inside it. I found a Voltron box. First party went overboard when I watched an ancient let's play done by one of the people who's popular, but oh. Part two found. It's a weird and small part of something. I can't even imagine what shape it was originally. I wonder what part it is. So we have part one and part two. Presumably there are five more parts. So that's cool. Where are we going? Um. Okay, there's the ghost girl. So I think this is the right way, and I want to go the wrong way first. Don't fucking. Oh, I guess I guess we're coming back that way is the thing. Gives the idea of a planet dying. It does sound really cool. It does sound like a really neat concept. Whoa! Whoa! Shit! Oh god! Damn it! Oh my god! Okay, I need my flashlight for that part. Ugh. More this. Oh, there, there were, there were three of them, and I juked into one of them. That's what happened. I think there might have been an item back there too. Fuck, dude. Puzzle five found. Dirty puzzle piece. I wonder kind of, what kind of picture is gonna make. So that's. Wait, I came up here to get a puzzle piece? For real, for real? Oh no, path keeps going this way. See you there. Are you okay? How you doing? You good? 
guess she's fine. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> That was well timed. I will give you credit. License plate found. A license plate that was attached to a car looks beat up and I can't really read it. Ugh. It won't open. Huh? There's something jammed in the door. Remove the object? Yeah. What is it? The dildo? That scared me. Uh, I can't take it anymore. You remove the stuck object. Robot's right arm. It's green colored right arm of robot is shaped like a car but has an elbow. We're getting lots of parts of thing. Lots and lots of- Oh my god! Okay, well maybe that's why. <laughs> Fucking scissors, man. Oh, okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait what, what the fuck was that? There's something right here that I need. Jesus Christ. Ah! Well, I got the robot's neck. Do I still have it? More teeth. That was a key item, so I'm gonna guess not. Yeah, it probably goes there. I'm thinking maybe we need an entire robot to sacrifice to this guy. Okay, there's the robot body. Part of the robot looks like the body, there's a star emblem on the chest. Shit. Okay, I got left arm. Robot toy is shaped like a truck. Parts can also make a robot. No! Oh! oh! Give me that. Okay, we got a neck. I don't know why the neck is. It's the head of a large robot with some horns on it. Looks cool. It was pretty beat up. Looks kind of sad. Motherfucker. Fuck, dude. This guy is such an asshole. That was maybe not a great idea. Uh, okay. I got the left leg. Blue and kind of clunky. Okay. Right leg found. You gathered all the pieces and completed the transforming robot. Okay. Whoa! My man, do you not? Oh, 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 I get it. I get it. I, I understand what's going on here. I need him to attack it. Maybe. Oh, I need to hold it, don't I? Please, God, don't let me fuck this up. There we go. I'm so dumb. You just have to pick it up. Girl's literally gonna assemble on this combined robot toy as well. Ghost tries to cut her head off. She's good. Okay. Emblem of courage found. I got a souvenir. The shiny emblem on the chest of the robot. You can see the gold plating even through the dirt on it. Woo. Okay. Another uh, adventure in Furies. I'm learning to cook properly. Fails. And it's the fucking metal grabby tongues in the pizza tray. I baked them with the pizza. Ooh, yikes. Yikes. 
Trophy found. Pretty trophy that shines a bright gold. I could just barely see it in the back of the dump. I'm glad I saw it. Huh? Oh. Okay, well, there's there's what's-her-face. Is it an old train? Yeah, sure, let's go inside the train cars. Dude, look at th look at this. Look at this scene. It's so pretty. Yeah, now it's a side-scrolling platformer. Uh, so cold. Well, there's a ghost lady. She is, in fact, saying it is so cold. Uh, so, 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 someone, please. Oh, boy. This is not good. Here, we got some blood on us. Tacos can't melt steel beams. Huh? A puddle? Did you not notice the puddles earlier, child? Thanks, I hate it. Here she is. Hello, friend. Okay. Uh oh. This is great because I can't see shit. Clean your screen, streamer. Okay. We we are in some degree of danger. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. Okay, girl. It's, uh, it's, everything's, it's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's gonna be fine. It's great. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Christ. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, oh, God. Oh god, the blood the blood drip slow you down. Jesus Christ, I didn't notice that. Stop fucking appearing right in front of me! I hate it. Door. Oh, okay. I just I just got to walk past her for some reason. Oh! Okay, don't go that way, I guess. Okay, pick it up from here. This is the best frozen pizza. Nice. Lady, I'm really sad you're cold, but like, there's not really a whole lot I can do about it, okay? Like, I'm, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. Am I now death adder? We golden axe. We golden axe now. Yeah, I agree. Oh, we're just, okay, that was just the door. Could you stop? Oh. Run! 
He wants to go home. There's nothing I can do for them. I can't rescue someone who's dead. Is she writing Lincoln Park lyrics? Oh my god, right before the stream. Like sometimes, sometimes I will start something up on YouTube right before the stream just to make sure that my earbuds are working and all the sound levels are right. I was listening to Linkin Park's In The End on Trombone Champ. It was so funny. D don't, aw, oh, don't leave me. There is a, the In The End Naruto uh, AMV. I got an umbrella. Dougie! Wait a second. This is where we saw Yui earlier. I think I was to I think I was supposed to take the umbrella backwards. Yui isn't here anymore. I, w I might not have that. I might not have the chance anymore. That might be the end of the night. Yeah, I think it is. Yui, I want to see you. Yeah, fuck. <clears throat> Haru? Yui isn't here anymore. Huh? Haru, I'm right here. Yui. Where are you? Yui, I want to see you. Haru, she can't see me. I want to see you. I'm so lonely, Yui. Haru, I... I'm so sorry, Haru. I'm probably already dead. Oh. Chaco, I... I must have died. But how did I die? If I go back there, maybe I'll remember something. I should go to the mountain. Haru can't hear me anymore. A letter, yeah. I'll leave her a letter.
Can we go this way? Ow. Taco's not gonna let us. I can see all those other ghosts, but not Yui. There may be a reason for that. There may be a particular reason for that. Yui may be a ghost, but she may not be the same kind of ghost. Takoi. That day, that afternoon, I already... Maybe not a full ghost yet. I'm going to the mountains again. I need to know why I died. Chako. Take care of Haru. Was she already dead in the post tree intro? Hmm. I'm really not sure how the chronology of it works out. I'm not sure, like I'm not actually sure if she was dead during the fireworks. All oh, right, I don't have a map. Oh, she actually has a Jizo statue for once. All right, we ain't going that way. You portal other G uh, Jesus statues is Yui. I don't think so. They didn't. They didn't offer me the. They didn't offer me the option. They normally do. It's weird. She doesn't have a map. All right, we ain't going that way. Maybe not going this way. Redhead, thank you so much for the raid. How you doing tonight? What were you up to? Hello. Oh, baby ghosts. Wait, 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 wait. wait. That's interesting. Baby Ghost doesn't have any interest in her. Do Rusty on some Doom Eternal in preparation for possible Ultra Nightmare Run? Damn. Good luck with that. Yeah, she can't portal. If the face and the flames of that tire was a little friendlier, I'd say it should probably be like a like a Mario or a Kirby enemy. Ah, Yui's house. My house. Huh? There's something on the ground. It's a letter from Haru. Haru's looking for me. Well, you know, you know that. But first, I I need to remember what happened to me that day. If you swallow, does it give you fire or wheel? Good question. Good question. My vote is wheel because wheel is awesome. And there is, yeah, there is an enemy in Kirby, a wheel enemy that does a flaming dash. It's true. Holy Christ. Okay. Oh, 
Okay. Was the thing in the intro intentional where she pushed? I missed, but I uh, got the end result. Um, as presented, as presented in the intro, um, she did it to herself. But, but that may, that may very well not be the full story. Like for example, in the first game, um, the 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 evil mountain spirit, Mr. Yomawari, was the actual cause of pretty much all the all the untimely demises in uh, in town. Okay, we'll hide back here. Okay, apparently that fixed it. So I'm guessing I'm guessing Scissor Man in this one may have had something to do with Yui's demise. So it's probably not it's probably not as cut and dry as it appeared in the intro. Yeah, <laughs> scissor man, cut and dry. <laughs> so fucking clever. That wasn't a prompt to teleport. That was just, I accidentally mashed the button again. And it was like, do you wanna? Those guys are a problem. Or sorry, or RE8 DLC today was pretty good. I went to 11 out of 10 anime bullshit. Is that a bad thing? The RE game, like, it, at least in my experience with the RE games, they always go kind of gonzo by the end. They like, they, they like to have a big blowout in the grand finale. And not to hear you're punching the shit out of sentient mold. That afternoon, Chaco and I walked along this path. But why did I go towards the mountains? I should have been trying to rescue Haru. And then, and then what did I do? I know I didn't want to leave Haru. Why did Kuro, what was I again? Haru, Haru. Hmm, okay. I guess we're about to cha trace the same path. There's a note on the ground. When did this get here? What? Is this a letter from Yui? How did this get here? You already, you already asked. What is that? Well. Bork, bork. What's up, Dave? Your old pal. What happened? Oh, yeah. I found a letter from Yui. But where the hell am I? <laughs> where am I now? I need to go back to where I find Yui's letter. I have to get out of here.
Okay, we're... Oh, we're at the... Oh my god, there's... Holy shit, there's an entire second map in this? Holy shit. Finally, is this because Japan has good gun control stopping us from just shooting the guns? This does look a lot like the factory from the first game. I will say that. Hello. What? Well, that would explain why. Them. <laughs> Alceras knew that was coming. There's also an item back up there. I'll wait for that one to go in again. Mortis. Oh, hey. Actually didn't die too fast. Yeah, throw a rock at it. That's the ticket. Use the Moonlight Greatsword. Whoa there, champion. Okay, is he actually gone? Because if he's gone, I know there was an item back there. A rock? Seriously? Even bother to give me a fucking old newspaper, a piece of lint, rusty something. I got a rock, big ass rock, maybe like a cinder block. I heard something. There's something weird. But then again, because certain Twitch's on Mac systems would prevent me saying the same thing twice that quickly. Yeah, that actually, somebody got, got got for that yesterday, as I recall. Then have you ever played receiver two? When one of the funniest things is, if you mishandle your weapon when you're holster, you shoot yourself in the leg. Do that with the desert eagle, and you just die. I have played receiver two, and yeah, I've done that. I'm, I'm sure you'll be shocked to learn. Oh! So I guess that was that guy? Interesting. I love the receiver games. Oh, fuck. He's like right there. Mini car found. A cool little red toy car. If it were a real car, I could just drive over and rescue you. Oh, it's so cute. Girls in this game are just so precious.
It's like, why can't I see him? That was concerning me greatly. The receiver to have VR support seems like the kind of game that should have VR support. I can't remember. What's up, Arcane? Yomori is going good. We uh, we actually ended up at the factory from the first game, surprisingly, because it turns out this game has two maps, and I guess the second one is at least part of the... Oh, shit. Is at least part of the original town. This is definitely the factory from the first game. Like, without a doubt. Yeah, this is this is not the character from the first game. Whoa! Shit. Are you maybe run from him again? Okay, good. You guys who ran out of kids in Zone Town, maybe you end up depopulating it. We don't we don't know how far in the future this is. So maybe they're just all gone. <laughs> he had to catch them all, and he did. Man, did I get blowed up by a ghost baby? Is that what happened? Oh fuck, there's two of them. I got a toy ring. Red ring, it looks like real jewelry. I don't think it'll look good on me, but it's perfect for Yui. I still got the car, right? Yeah. So yeah. I still got my mini car. Fuck, 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 come on. Are right, this little girl's parents are gonna find her gone and that becomes a thing? So, um, I've kind of noticed nobody seems to have any parents in these games. I guess that's the guy that exploded me last time. Oh, Christ. No, maybe that is. <laughs> maybe that is. Holy shit. I think maybe I'm not supposed to go that way. I think maybe we take this back. Little brown hair uh, girl said her mom was probably worried, didn't she? She did, but it's not like you're ever gonna see her. Third game offhandedly references a parent near the start. Thing is, I don't actually know what I can do with a board. I didn't see any obvious gaps to cross. Charles Schultz parents. <laughs> okay, let's find out if we can go around this guy. And sadly, if we need if we need the board over there, I'm gonna have to drag it along. Okay. This ledge here, just a little more, and I could climb it. 
I wonder if I can use something as a step. Yeah. Two ghosts are just vibing. So that guy doesn't appear until I get near him. Shit, Jesus Christ, man. Yeah, it's just, so the thing about the board, the thing about the board is you can't see, like you, you don't have your flashlight up while you're carrying it. Parents and horror stories exist only to die, be evil, or be absent when the kid needs them most. Okay, so there is whack, wacky waving arm inflatable tube guy. All right, there's the giant happy bug. Please don't kill me. Please don't explode me. Okay. It's just happy to be here. Okay. That coin was going to get me killed. Oh, thank God. <laughs> wheel, wheel, wheel. What do we have here? All right. This Jizo statue also doesn't warp because I guess you can't warp between towns. Yeah, tire tracks are warnings for the blaze wheels. There were enemies like that in the first game, that, but they had no warnings, and it sucked. Um, whoa, that's probably not good. Yeah, that's extra. That's super not good. I hate it. Scaring the fuck out. No! <laughs> Alright, we're going this way. Fuck, 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 fuck. Okay. I got a rock. Hide the bush! Jump the bush, child! He definitely won't find us here. Yeah, Sailor Peter, that was super awkward. So did she throw that rock or did something else throw that rock? What is his deal? Yes, yeah, someone threw a rock. Oh Christ, hi. No, no baby. No ghost baby. <laughs> Fuck shit. No. Ghost baby. Ghost baby. God damn it, ghost baby. I 
can't see where I'm fucking going with these guys around. Ah! Fucking Mr. Yomawari. I hate this asshole. Doesn't everybody? That is a lot of fucking tires. That's the Omori, isn't it? Somebody in chat said it was. Although, okay, hang on, wait a second. Wait, now that I'm thinking about it, didn't, didn't this guy, didn't the heart guy, didn't he get impaled? at, like, during Night Alone? Wasn't Mr. Yomawari actually the mountain spirit, the big face? The, the hand. Uh, the, the big hand spirit at the end. Don't think so? Okay. Hmm. All right, so fuck the fa the factory. We're done there. Got enough of that. Finger it out eventually. Did you hear that? What the hell? Dude, it's some guy going, oi. Oh. Oi. Do not want. I can honest I can honestly say I was oh shit. Oh god, I remember this Langolier looking motherfucker. Oh god. This may take a couple tries. <laughs> I wonder if we'll do it again. First one's around here. No, I guess not. Oh. Oi! <laughs> what? Boom! <laughs> it looks like a big ball of uh, squid ink pasta. Yeah, I was not at all expecting this to become a bullet, uh, like a bullet hell. Wall of flesh and legion say hello. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I hear the phone. Who is it? I got it. I'm pretty sure it's for me. Whoa there, champ. Okay, I guess it's not for me.
That is a really inconvenient place for that ball. At least those Langoliers don't stick around for too long. Can I answer that? No? Okay. Fuck you too. Oh, oh, fuck. Oh my god! Alright, he, he's definitely he's definitely getting way more aggressive about this. Mr. Oi is not playing around anymore. What was that? Oh, what the fuck? Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay. Okay. <gasps> Centipede! Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, get fucked. I can see this part not making sense if you didn't play the first game. Because this is the centipede shrine from the first game, and one of the one of the knights in Night Alone, you help um you help basically a giant centipede deity that literally has itself wrapped around the entire town. Um and you gain its protection. You basically you basically learn that the giant centipede creature or spirit is actually a good thing. So as soon as I saw that centipede in the street, I was like, okay, I'm safe. Whereas somebody who didn't play the first game might be like, oh fuck, a big gross centipede, I'm not going in there, and then they would die. Yeah, we just looped around downtown. Okay, I heard Chaco. Where you at, Chaco? No pay phone. I'm going to call home. Looks like it's not working. Oh, never mind. What? Call BS, no centipede would be nice. I'm... I would agree with you, but this one, like, no, nobody's gonna fuck with this one. <laughs> you, you had to be there. This thing was imposing. Doggy! Chekhov centipede, yes, exactly. Hey, you came to get me, huh? I have to go back to where I found Yui's letter. All right. Yeah, Jizo first. You suppose there's anything down here of interest? Looking for witnesses. Huh. Large amounts of downtown have been cordoned off. It looks like it's being demolished. Or maybe it's under construction. I found a pachinko ball! Small metal ball. You said that adults love to play with this. It's true. They do. 
How did Yui a ghost make a physical letter? How do ghosts kill physical people? Heart attack. So every time we get that big death screen, it's our heart exploding from fear. Oh, that's cool. It's one of the ghosts from the first game. An old yellow flyer poster thing. It's a shopping mall coming soon. We advise residents of the downtown area to relocate for construction. Ah, uh, okay. So the down the downtown shop. Hey, I remember you. The downtown shopping district from the first game is being torn down. And they're gonna build a new shopping mall in its place. This is it's it's honestly really cool that they use all they're using all the same enemies from the first game. How is the mall scene in Japan? Um very active. This No, this isn't where I went in before, is it? Um they build incredibly fancy malls in Japan. And they're very, very nice. Ectoplasm rifles, how the ghosts get us, or how Yui made the letter. I love those weird eyeball koi. <laughs> I don't like those. I guess it's pretty likely we're going to be spending some time in here, so I guess we'll be back. Kid. Oh fuck. Scribble kid. Or of scribble kid. Alright, head back to town. Head back to our town. Town we know and love. So we are okay. So that's that takes us to nearby town. Oh, dude, we're just north. We're right up above um, that place in the woods. Paper scrap seven. Uh, looks like a note says goodbye, 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 goodbye. You won't like this weird eyeball koi when you have to navigate a moving maze consisting of them? That would be cool. That would actually be a pretty neat little challenge. Taco! Porf, porf! The- God damn these things. These things are so fuck. Oh, there's an item here. Can I get that without exploding? No, it's just funny. Alright, we made it back to Yui's letter. Good little poof ball. Birdo! Hey, how you doing, buddy? Good to see you. It's been a while. How's the baby? How's the baby doing? I hope the baby's not watching too. This one's pretty spoopy. <laughs> There's a lot of screaming in this one. There. The letter from Yui. She's up. 
Hi, baby. <laughs> Glad you could join us. You're gonna need therapy for this one. Couple, couple years. I should read it. Wow, she never even got to read the letter. Your creatures are becoming angry. <laughs> Taharu, it looks like it's over for me. I think that I am dead and I am now a spirit. <laughs> if I was killed, it must have been that time I went to the mountain. In order to remember what happened, I'm going to go back there. Haru, thank you for looking for me. But it's okay now. Thank you. I'm sorry. It's not okay. No, that's that's a lie. You he died? We did find a missing poster for her, didn't we? Girl, that ain't no closure. Oh, we did get her dog. That's like a consolation prize. Sort of. It's impossible. I don't believe it, because I went with Yui to the fireworks. I remember her hand was warm, but if she was dead, then why did she die? Since when was she a ghost? I don't care if she is a ghost. I want to see her again. She's been imagining Yui after the tree? I don't know. I actually got an achievement for that. So yes, I have never been this far in the game before. This is all, this is all brand new territory for me. Maybe she's a medium? Could be. Could be. Um, sometimes run faster. Let's try this. I want to sometimes run faster. Emblem of Brave Sir Robin. That's all we know how to do is run away. All right, uh, no conveniently placed Chaco this time. But I mean, it's pretty obvious how to get to the mountains, so cross the bridge, up around the way, past Yui's house. All right, let's do it. Ah. Rock! Damn, I don't want to rock. Oh, th that feels like, that felt like I was running faster than normal. I had too much shit, chat. Am I following me? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, th this is going to be a bit much, thank you. Christ, okay. That order to Yui is lying there, that means Yui isn't back yet. Co Ghost Puddle Spearman Ambush. There's your fucking mad libs for the evening. Of these guys. They're really loud sometimes. Um, out of curiosity, what's this way? I guess it's locked. 
Oh, it's the entrance. Okay, it's the entrance to some fucking tunnel. I bet that's gonna be great. Streaming Mad Libs would be kind of fun. That could be fun. Can't find what sometimes specifically means in the sometimes runs faster. It feels like there's occasionally little pulses in her speed. Like it's it's subtle enough that I I can't really tell a difference. But I I, I feel like it's working. <laughs> The last time we saw Yui in her section, she was sitting here on the bridge. <laughs> cool, okay. Dive into the underbrush! Quick! Yes, go through the grass. You fucking kidding me? Dear God goes. Dear God got fat, okay? Dear God has really let himself go since Mononoke. Oh. Well, now what? There's spirits this way. Okay, so we can't go that way. So what, do we just give up? Oh, Chaco's back here. Dear God is one fourth Mad Libs. Thank you. He came to save me. Fourth. You're very brave. Very stupid. But either way, good boy. It's a bunch of spirits on the mountain. I need to take a different path up. Oh! Dwarf! Ah, uh, wait! I definitely don't know if the dog survives the game. I'm inclined I'm inclined to believe that he does. Oh shit. Oh shit, don't be the tunnel. Please don't be the tunnel. Huh? Oh, what's that over there? It. Oh. Oh, shit. Sewer level acquired. You want me to go in there? You actually fucking expect me to go in there? Sewer count 200 something civvy joke here. If I go through here, I might come out somewhere on the mountain. I might also come out smelling like shit. I might also drown in shit. Old key I found near the sewers, there's dirt on it, and it's cold as ice. Yeah, I guess it's locked. Fucking shocking. We're trusting a dog right now. Dog did just save our life. Uh... Christ. Yeah! Hell yes! Wait my whole life for this. Well, this looks like... Shit. Child has the loudest footsteps in existence. <laughs> what an incredible smell you've discovered.
This girl walks like my 11-year-old does. I swear to God, like, my daughter is angry at the floor. Like, she is trying to kill the floor with her feet the way she walks. I'm like three times as heavy as her, and she makes so much more noise than I do. Clomping around. Dude, some... Oh, God. Something is coming up out of this water, and I'm going to hate it so much. She hates gravity. Throw a rock in the water, that'll teach it. Can I throw a rock in the water? Oh, that's cool. I'm also not very encouraged by the vibrating rats. Every day I go to the paranormal zoo to look at the deer gods. Sometimes raining, there's a sewer level. If I'm a professional dog, you know how to float. That, I know what it is. That is okay. That clickety-clackety thing, I have no idea. Looks like it's locked. Okay, okay, that's great. Okay, so whatever is in the water has arms and will splat us. Dice! Found dice! Dice with six numbers on it, you won't know what number you get until you throw it. Amazing. The microphone is shaking in terror. I'm. I may be vibrating with fear myself. It's possible. Child like ninety nine point nine percent braver than I am. I I would lose my fucking mind if I did this. I've really been enjoying watching some uh, ghost hunting shows on TV, or not TV. Jesus Christ, on YouTube. Guess it's locked. Okay, not the sewer key. So we need to go back and find a key for this one. Yeah, I've been watching some ghost hunting shows on YouTube, and when they do when they do their solo investigations, I like I just think about how I would absolutely lose my mind if I did that. You can tell they merely slam the floor if it actually placed that mouse too. <laughs> The ghost of a loving rat owner. It's like, here, buddy, play with the nice girl. You'll feel better. See that noise? I don't know what that noise is. The clickety clackety clattery noise? It keeps getting loud and then disappearing. Was that? Rats are criminally overused for scares. Rats are lovely. Rats are lovely. I do appreciate the rats aren't really being used as scares in here. Okay. We got wall arms. Emergency telephone. An emergency payphone. In the sewer. Good. Oh, Christ! Fuck! Dude, 
I do not know how you timed it. I mean, that was pretty serendipitous on your part. But that played exactly when I saw that guy. That was fucking amazing. That's no good. All right, so I guarantee as soon as I pick this key up, Muddy Key found some shit is gonna go down. Key with moss growing on, I found in the sewers. Maybe I can use it if I scrape off the moss. I wonder what door it opens. Oh, okay. We got mood, mood mans. Oh, we've got multiple mud mans. Boy, I hope it goes to this fucking door. Because otherwise we die. There we go. Rat, I'm trusting you on this. If you're in a sewer, I don't think that's mud. I gotta be watching the water too for those uh I have sharp teeth. No. I have wings, no. I have large claws, no. Do you know how I am? No. Oh, I think I might have fucked that up. Choose the form of the destructor. Oh. All right. What? Okay, well, I guess that had to happen. What do we get? Red key found. An old key I picked up in the sewers is red with rust. I wonder how long it's been lying there. I guess we use, yeah, we use the new key, okay. We're, you, okay, I actually noticed something. We're honestly running out of space for items, for key items. It seems like there might only be two more key items in the game, which is kind of surprising, because we haven't, I mean, maybe there's just no more key items for these other areas. Because we haven't been to the pond. We haven't been to the dam. There's an observatory. No, I don't think it was this way. I think it was this way. Maybe they have branching paths in some locales swap. I don't know. I don't remember any of the location. No, this is the wrong way. I don't remember any of the locations in the in the original game being like optional. That I can remember. My mermaid, and that's why I love the floor. You see, my mom is a hole cutter. And she just likes shaking. The floor doesn't allow shaking, so it means I can become a hole cutter mermaid too. Wow. I feel like we've all grown a bit as people from that. All right, rusty key go. Uh, 
Oh, I think some shit's gonna go down. Are you taking the idea of mad live and run with it? I think it's a good idea. I think it works. Hey, we're playing. You're so getting jumped. You're into sewers and shit always going down here. Good point. Oh, okay, hide. Oh, fuck. Oh, God, there's two of them. There's an item over there. I got a... Is that a fucking car battery? Like, what the hell did I just pick up? Oh, my God. Ser seriously, what did I just pick up? Oh, it's a firefly. Okay, so now I have fireflies I can drop. Alright, Rattata, I see you there. Just hang on a sec. Maybe... No, there's no... I have no idea what fireflies are for. Okay, there's an item over on that side. Oh, mud, mud's mans. All right, well, I guess I guess we're just going then. I would love to pick up that item, but I don't want to die for it. Place them out of order at the wrong time and then cancel them after one season. <laughs> Aww. Whoa! Floor hands almost got me. in here oh somebody exploded in here awesome uh oh I may have fucked up I may have fucked up real bad I have sharp teeth yes I have wings yes I have large claws you know who I am? Yes. I don't think they like that answer either. Oh my god, it's a rat ghost. Crow looks dead. Well, how the hell do I get out of here? He doesn't seem to care about rocks. Maybe I need to go. Maybe I need. Oh, fuck. He's like right there. Jesus, like right behind me. Maybe I need to do the poster again? No, I can't do the poster again. <laughs> ah! Okay, this this might be this might be kind of stupid, but No 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 child. You need to actually use it. Okay. This got us out last time. All right, that was it. You just have to cover your eyes. It 
Was that sparkly thing? It was. It was a trash bag. It was. Oh fuck you, man. It was the trash bag we need to get out of there. In case you hadn't brought your own from home, that was a trash bag you used to escape. God damn it. Alright, I guess we're going through here then. I feel bad for the crows in this game. They don't seem to fare very well. Well, this sucks. I said double up on those. All right. Fuck it, we're out of here. I think maybe we've survived the sewers, potentially. Unless that fucking rat thing is in here again. Is this locked? Wait, what is, wait, 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 what is this? What is this? Oh, you know, that's a good point. We still don't know what's making those, those giant, like, oh, you want to take the door first? Oh shit, okay. Thank you. Yeah, we don't actually know what's making the big shakes in this area. We haven't seen that yet, so. It's outside. Ah, oh, nice. Ah, uh, okay. So we we can't actually go this way yet. I guess, I guess whatever we do in here is going to help us get past that section. Because, of course, Tiny Haru can't get past those, uh, those barricades and cones. God. Perish the thought of a child passing by a cone unimpeded. Yes, insurmountable waist-high objects. Yo! What in the fuck? Is that a crab? Is that a giant, like, demon crab? Holy fuck. Hang on. Hey, I'm crabbing over here. Whoa, 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 You don't need to, you don't need to be doing that. Is there an item? Yeah, there's an item. It's a coin? Fucking for real? That is nuts. And yet something tells me that's still not like the big evil of this area. Whatever it is. Alright, there's an item over there. 100 coins gets you an extra life, bruh. Okay. Uh, 
Um, how do I get past these guys? Distract with a rock? Okay. I guess I wasn't close enough. Pocket watch found. The watch small enough to fit in my pocket. The hands have stopped though. Not even the second hand works. Give me other rocks. You can have that one. Scares that crab look because it goes side to side. It'll only catch, catch absolute more. Oh, yeah. White rats, you would tell us where, uh, would you tell us where you're taking us? That would be great. Yeah. That is for them to know and us to perish in our ignorance from. This is a crazy ass sewer system, by the way. <laughs> I kind of love it. Like I wish I wish structures like this existed in the real world. There's no reason for them to. There is no Oh, that's interesting. Uh double the vibrating rats. No. There's literally no reason to build a structure like this, but still I want to see it. Chief engineer of this small town must have been really ambitious. I'm I'm not really Oh, great. I'm not super up on my Yomawari lore. So I don't know, like... Oh, my God. I'd like to believe that there's some kind of lore reason why this is built here. Like, it wasn't actually really built for the town, but it has, like, an another another sinister purpose or something. Yeah, I'm not risking that. Giant eye spaghetti monster down here. I think giant eye spaghetti monsters in the other town. Cause he was, he was, Rats have kind of ceased to help me anymore. Yeah, thanks for nothing, guys. Um, yeah. I think Spaghetti Eyeball Monster is in the other town. I think he's the new, he's probably the, the new big bad haunting the shopping district. Jesus. I wish games like this had a bestiary. It definitely would be would be neat to be able to see the mon at the same time though. At the same time though, I think I think the the mystery of them does a lot for the atmosphere of the game. I kind of saw that coming. More of this. I also got an achievement for dying twenty times. Centipede God seems to have lost a lot of strength, so it seems reasonable. There is an item down there. I want it. Okay. Woo! Puzzle seven. Okay. I missed puzzle six. Well, I mean, I missed puzzle... I missed a couple puzzle pieces, honestly. I missed a lot of stuff, honestly. Puzzle one, missed two and three, four, five, missed six, seven. Looks like there's 10 puzzle pieces total. 
really hard to get everything without a guide. That was true. That was true in the original game as well. I know. I know there was at least one haunting that, like, even if you knew exactly what you were supposed to do with it, I can't believe I survived that. Um, it was like a huge pain in the ass to get it to actually happen. Rats, are you? Do you need to be like that? Is this a dead crow? Why is it all covered in, oh fuck. Oh, it's, it's the rat demon. Buddy. Oh God! It is many rat demons. Oh, come on, man. Oh shit, Chaco! Chaco gave him what for? Doggy! Did you save me? Good boy! Thank you. Good Chaco. Good Chaco saving my life. Now nah, Crow's the dead one. <laughs> my dog would have knocked me over. <laughs> Dog that led us here in the first place, he's just playing the long con. Yeah, let's go outside. Sad that the rats were evil after all. I don't know about evil, maybe just malicious. Maybe just mischievous. Damn you traffic cones. Whoa, look at the scenery, y'all. Yo, oh, what the fuck? Crow? Where are all these dead crows? Oh my God. Okay. It's suddenly a Castlevania boss. Jesus fuck, dude. I swear, like, the the monster design this, in this one are so much more intense than the first game. Welcome to Wall Maria, the Titans hope you enjoy your stay. All right, away from the hands. I thought I thought they wanted to give me a nice cradling hug. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> yeah, I was worried because that that hand pulled up. I guess we want to stay under the middle, at least until she does whatever this is about to be, maybe? Okay. This is clearly going to take some trial and error. Right working, this is fucking dope as hell. It is, yeah. Quick, somebody put that one in before I die again. More this. Thank y'all. Okay. Alright, 
I'm gonna stick to the original plan. I'm gonna stay, I'm gonna stay right under her skull. Until I have a compelling reason not to. I thought glowing eyes meant, meant I was gonna get like, like laser beamed or something, but. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I guess we just wanna stay here for a while. Maybe if she lifts up her other arm. Can I just, can I leave? Maybe we can get the hell out of here. Ooh, maybe I can get out of here. Maybe I can't. I mean, that did sort of seem like progress though. Okay, I think that was progress. I think maybe that is what we're supposed to do. Who knew the right in video games in progress? It's true. Kind of reminds me of my favorite part of Alan Wake where you're running along the dam. Alan Wake had a lot of really good parts in it, honestly. Alan Wake is one of those weird games where the the weakest the weakest part of it is like at the very beginning. Like the near the near endless running through the woods. Doggy! Yeah, Barker ass to death. Second death. Fuck off. Rats? Guys. Seriously. You can't be doing this shit. I think Skeletron is really bad aim. Yeah, I think I think the 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 wandering around in the woods for the first couple hours of Alan Wake is is the weakest part of it. I think it goes on for a little too long. Once you get to the town, I feel like Alan Wake really picks up and it just never stops after that. Like each each area, each set piece is just like better than the last at that point. Sheba barks are too strong. I think this is a Pomeranian, isn't it? A Sheba would be like a little bread loaf there. So I guess, yes, this is the dam. All right, we've, we've made it to the dam. Don't you do it, game? I don't think the dog's gonna die. I, I have I have high hopes for the dog. Honk. Uh, big shell, I have to hold with both hands. When I put it to my ear, I can hear it crying. <laughs> I can't hear the ocean. I can hear misery. Yay, Chaco! <laughs> I really like the beginning to one of the last chapters where you're driving around in the early morning because you have brain and a long way to go. Oh yeah, I know exactly what you're talking about. And yes, that's a great moment. Because it has, yeah, it's really, I'm not afraid anymore. There's a dead mouse here. It was delicious.
Eat it, absorb its power. Dude, then we could turn into a giant skull lady. It's the power of the 12 foot skeleton. I have sharp teeth. Yes. I have wings. No. I have large claws. Uh. Yes? Yes. You're. Did I fuck that up? I feel like maybe large claws was wrong. I don't understand. I don't want to see ghosts, but if I can't see ghosts, then I won't be able to see Yui either. How did it end up like this? After I find ghost Yui, then what do I do then? I don't know, child. Life is hard. Large claws would be a sloth. Ghost sloth could be pretty terrifying. Oof. Morph. Oh, are we on the map? Okay, we're way over here now. What were we saying about that bit now and way the cutscene started playing? Oh, right, 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 right. Um, yeah, I remember the part uh, where you're, it's morning, it's finally morning. Like, it's been night for so long. You have been doing everything at night and you've been through so much. And if I remember correctly, you know what you're doing at that point. Like, you have, you have a final directive and you're you're in your car and you're driving towards it and i just i just remember that scene that whole sequence having this wonderful air of finality to it because it was such it was such a switch in in tone and atmosphere and i just remember being really really impressed by that part we went long. You could finish this tonight. There's some post game content if you want to take it slow, though. Uh, we'll we'll just see what happens. I did not realize I was this close to the end. Doggy. Yeah, we'll see what's happening. I was already planning on playing this uh, again tomorrow. Um, and if we finished early tomorrow, uh, I've got some other stuff that we can do too. Dam's lake is all dried up. I should be able to go straight to the mountain now. So in, in this case, it doesn't really make much of a difference if we finish it tonight or if we finish it tomorrow. Sequence has a great calm before the storm feels probably one of the longest stretches of the game where you don't fight anything. And then you fight a lot, yeah. Yes, you do. Isn't the power station after that? With the lamp lady? Uh, what was that? Oh, that thing's cute. What are you, you little fucking goofball? Gross little thing. Okay, so I can hide behind that. This is a weird environment. Yo, oh shit, okay. That's just before Alan leaves his friends there and goes off with MacGuffin, and that's why he's driving. Ah, okay, okay. Uh, I think that's one of those Mudman things. Oh, yeah, it's a bunch of Mudman things. Let's 
see here. Oh, I can hide behind a log. Neat. Or stump, rather. I know what things are called. Yes, I do. Oh! Guys, 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 you don't have to be like that, okay? Oh, that's not good. Oh, this is a really bad mix. Girl needs a Glock. <laughs> or a proton pack or something. Anything. Yeah. Well this time we can try going the other way. Oh, there wasn't another way. There was an item I missed. Rainbow shell. A pretty shell with a bunch of different colors on it. When I put it right up to my nose, I got to smell the ocean. The darkness would eat these shitty ghosts for breakfast. So I guess there was like a little a, a little village or town here that ended up flooded when they built the dam. That's kind of creepy. Yeah, you can fuck off. You can fuck off. You can still fuck off. All y'all can fuck off. And then this thing is a problem. Oh my god, it's fucking Scissor Man. Jesus Christ. Fuck. Why is Scissor Man here? God damn it. Well, apparently he didn't notice this. Doggy! What do I do? A spirit, he got. What? You got what? You thought it was a heartbeat, but it was a claw. Oh, Shit! Oh, I didn't wave. I didn't actually wave my flashlight over it. God damn it! <laughs> that was not the right clipboard. I feel like that could have been More way worse. Only, I feel like the only drags in this game are sequences like this, where it's it's a ways between Jizo statues. Fuck. God damn it. God damn it. Shit. I wonder if there's a Jizo statue behind that guy. Like I either I either missed a Jizo statue in here somewhere or they're just too far apart for this sequence.
Okay. For a brief second, I thought I thought that was like a cutscene moment, but it wasn't. There's a little mud. There we go. Fuck. No. Shut up. Fuck off. God. There we go. Where are we? Oh, uh, I guess we're gonna end up at the shrine eventually. Looks like it's locked. The silver monkey. Oh God. Uh, had to hide behind the sign. I also don't love it when the game does that. V for Vendetta really let himself go. So I might put in that death. We're at 25 now. Hmm? So this, I don't remember, I don't remember this happening a lot in the first game. Where, like, hiding would actually cause specific things to happen. Like, in this case, Scissor Man showed up and fucking murked that guy. And is gonna murk us now. Doggo! Oh no! No, 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 dog! Dog, I don't think he goes for that. Oh, oh god, dog. Oh god, dog. Oh god, dog. Oh god, dog. Oh no! Wait, can I? Okay, I saved the dog. I'm not stupid, chat. I figured that out. I might have fucked up a bunch of other stuff in this game. But I'm not letting the dog get scissored. <laughs> Chaco's gotten a little overconfident after barking some rats. Doggy, that was not smart. I, I promise I will bring Yui home. You go, run. Go. Please. If you died, Yui would be sad. Okay, chat. We're not we're not making Yui sad. I think the I think the dog survives this. I'm pretty sure the dog survives. Us, on the other hand, I won't let you kill again. What's your plan here, girl? I'm not scared anymore. I'm not afraid of you anymore. I'm going to see Yui. Let me through. Yeah, he didn't, he didn't like that. 
like that. Yeah, he's, he ain't down with that. He's not okay with that. <laughs> I'm not afraid of you. <laughs> Here we go. Yep. Some fear is in fact justified. Instantly tricked by a sign, apparently. I mean, shit, I'll take it. You can use a nice, relaxing walk through the ruins. Old key found. Key I found buried in the dirt near the dam. It's a little bent. I wonder if it's still usable. Okay, so now we go back. He's so fast. It's so fast. He is fast. He is... Much like the big hand enemy in the original game. Uh, you have to you have to juke him most of the time. He also he's not doing it here, but he has a habit of teleporting. Like in, in some of the other chases we've done, if I get too far ahead of him. He'll just teleport ahead. Puzzle eight found. I don't know why I check these every time. They're always dirty puzzle pieces. Hello. There's something written on the monument. It's all smeared. I can't read it. Whoa! Oh! Like I said. No, come on, fuckhead. Oh god. No, 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 no. Don't be a shit. Oh my god. Yeah, when he starts doing his teleporting shit, that's when it gets really bad. Shit. Oh, monument, the letters are barely readable. Oh. Uh, at this shrine, we hold festivals for our god, Wari. This re relationship was merciful, saves the distressed people. Um, if you cannot endure and cry out, God will save you. I can't read anything past there. So this is the, sh this is the shrine for Yoma Wari, maybe? Unless there's another Wari guy. Camera Obscura, where are thou? There's an old poster pinned here. It says not to litter in this area. Oh god, she's gonna go see Wario. I <laughs> garlic and coins. Is that Pocky? I want some Pocky. Somebody has littered all over this fucking place and that's not cool. Also, the, the stonework in this little plaza is shaped like a person. Where is this? 
There's a shrine here. Covered in trash. He doesn't like litter! Oh my god, I actually have to- Oh, what? Okay, so we have, we have to physically move all the garbage off of these sections. Teleporting right in front of me, fuck face. Damn it, god damn it, god damn it! I hate it. I did it! Oh god, oh fuck, the entire game was just environmentalist prop propaganda all along. He's trying to cut the limbs off of this the stone person. So that's pretty wild. That is really wild, in fact. Yeah, you can relieve some aggression. The empty place. I'm somewhere I've never been before. I could never get here normally all by myself, but I promised that I would rescue Yui and her puppy. I have to keep my promise. Yeah, how's that working out for you, dipshit? There are a lot of wooden plaques tied up. I hope that they disappear. Die, 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 die. I can't take it anymore. Is what is written. <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right, we are here. I think we're actually pretty close to meeting up with the mountain path that Yui was on. Rich Ryan of Skittles, I'm beyond all hope at this point. This is Jizo. What are we doing tomorrow night? Um I guess it depends on if we finish this tonight or not. Oh shit, there she is. Yui! Seems like we're gonna finish this tonight? Let, let's see what happens first. Yui, you're... why? <laughs> why are you like this? Haru, you looked for me. Yui! I was so lonely. I was too, Yui. Haru. Haru, 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 I'm so lonely, Haru. Haru, please, please, I'm so lonely. We said we'd always be friends. We'd always be together, right? We promised, right? Whoa. Oh, God. Always, 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 always. Oh, holy shit. It's 
turned into a bullet hell. Haru, Haru, Haru! We promised, right? She likes this one. <sighs> Haru! Haru, 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 I'm so lonely, Haru! Please, 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 I'm so lonely! Alright, we're getting there. We're getting there. Yikes! So yeah, I, in, I interpret this as Yui becoming, like she's in the process of becoming one of one of the kinds of spirits that have been chasing us through the through these nights. Please take care of Chaco. Goodbye. Oh, there's a ribbon. The red ribbon that Yui always wore in her head. When I look at it, it makes my chest hurt and I start to cry. Um, I have to keep going. Okay, we have to keep going. I was going to check that side path. It's an old sign. In the mountains, do not answer the words that you may hear. No matter what you hear, ignore the voices. What is that? All right, ignore the voices. Don't fuck it up like you fucked up that one thing in the field. Chat count as a voice? I never listen to you anyway. <gasps> it's Kuro's grave! We're trying to reach you about your car warranty. On top of a small grave, there lies a neatly folded paper. Ah, Yui's letter? I should read it. Summer is almost over. My name is Yui and I'm in elementary school. Yesterday, my dog died. It's been hard. I cried a lot. First my dad died and then my mom started acting weird. That's why I depended on Haru so much. If I could have stayed friends with Haru, I would have been fine. But when summer ends, Haru is going to move to a town far away. All of the things I love are leaving me. Saying goodbye is too painful. I can't do it anymore. I don't want anything anymore. Oof. Yui's will is an interesting way to phrase that. Yui is... Oh, God. Whoa.
All right. We keep going. Nothing else we can do. So we're, we are way the hell up here. Way, way, way the hell up here. Can't go, can't go past the feel good Japanese folks. We're gonna hold RB to, that's weird. It's like tutorializing and get, wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh no. Yo, dude. This is, okay, this is honestly probably the, like, one of the coolest callbacks I've ever seen in a game. I mean, it's horrifying, because I know what this means. I think, I think that's what it means, Mr. Alien. I think the sign was trying to warn us. Because it's literally telling us to do the same thing that Yui did. Well, shit. Like... Jesus Christ. Oh! I hear Chaco! A note? Tomorrow is fireworks day. I promised Haru that we would go. Haru's going to move away. But one day I hope that I can see the fireworks again with her. Even after she moves away, I'm going to write her a bunch. Maybe next summer I'll see Haru again. Ah! This note, Yui? It was the voices. All right, fuck this shit. It's the tutorial! The tutorial's trying to kill you! <laughs> That's so fucking cool! Oh my god, I love it! Uh, I don't know how you answer this. No. Fuck you. No! 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 Just a little further, no. I can't take it anymore. No! Oh, I think it might be I can't take it anymore. How sad! Oh, 
How sad, how sad, how very, very sad. Mr. Kotowari. I can't hear the voice anymore. Thank you. Thank you so much. Wait. Why did you save me? Because I called for you? Because I said I couldn't take it anymore? Relationship scissors found. Big, bright red scissors. They're very sharp, and it looks like they could cut my arm easily. Yeah, funny you should mention that. Every time Mr. Kotowari shows up in is after she yells she can't take it anymore. I guess, I guess we're going in the hole then. This isn't claustrophobic at all. The statue is not a Jesus statue. I think it was a I think it was a Buddha statue. The red spider web, it's huge. I've never seen this before. Yeah, cut it. Right. Kotowari is Japanese for refusal. Interesting. Luckily we have the red key. Oh, Yui. Hey. Should we leave us on? Yui? She did. She left us something. Paper scrap two found. It says, I can't say goodbye to Haru. Tomorrow I'll tell her we should meet again. Red spider web. I get the feel I, I get the feeling whatever the final spirit is is gonna be spidery. <laughs> hmm? Is she running from something? No! Oh! Well that was some foreshadowing, wasn't it? Shit. It's a dude named Jeff. The bitrate hated that second. So what do I do with spooters? Yeah, okay, great. Great, 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 great. She just took off. So yeah, I, I gotta I gotta get to the next area when one of those shows up.
Whoa! What the shit? Ah. The spikening. Oh my god. Okay, I'm not actually sure what I'm supposed to do about that. Well, that's. Right. <laughs> if it's too scary, find a way around. Ah, okay, but that's nice. They actually, they actually don't hit you with the previous challenges again. I appreciate that. Well, okay, they might, they may, they might make me do the next one. But. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. This one, though, what do I do about this one? <laughs> oh, God damn it. Is that they jiggle for a few seconds before chasing you down? Yeah. Should you go on the lower bit of path? Maybe that gives you enough room to sneak by. I don't think you can sneak by them. I don't think. Squeeze by, yeah. Maybe, okay, yeah, maybe start down here and then... Oh, maybe you just, oh, Christ. Maybe you just sneak past them entirely. Okay, I should I should have been paying more attention to what exactly she did. That was that was just me being dumb then. Oh! Wow. I got splattered. More <laughs> I need to be looking for shadows on the ground. I guess now they're gonna combine the two. Oh god, yeah. Oh no, 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 no. I thought they were gonna combine the spiders with things falling from the sky. Okay, what's she doing here? She throws a rock. Okay, she throws a rock and then she hides in the bush. All right. Aha. Mm. 
Yo! I don't, I don't understand what these spiders are doing, man. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. And yeah, I see bodies falling from the sky again. Oh man, okay, I think that was it. Jesus. What an ordeal that was. Not as bad though. Not as bad as the final ascent from uh, the first game. I found that one super frustrating. Because you had... Fuck. Oh shit. Oh my god. Giant spider elder god? That does kind of seem like what it, what this is. Yeah, the ascent in the first game... Uh, that one, that one really pissed me off, because you had to juke the hands so many times going up the mountain. Is that... What? Yeah, we've been here before? I've been to this place before. And then, Yui and I, Yui, Yui. Aww. Maybe not the best place to break down and cry, but, uh... I have to keep moving. Are we even on the map? Oh, we're in- we're in the bad place, apparently. <laughs> New Jersey. Car insurance brand called Yui or something uh, over here so I get a chuckle. Oh. Come, come, come save me. How sad, how sad. You can save them. Come, come. Come with me, come with me. How sad, how sad. Well, there's a, there's a Yui. Yui, Yui, Yui! Yui, wait! There's something I want to tell you. How sad, how sad. Come, come with me. Come to me. Come here, come here. <laughs> oh boy. Yui! How sad, how sad. How sad, how sad. Go with her? No! Oh, I bet I need to cut this. There we go. Okay. Don't move. I ain't listening to you, fuckhead.
Ah! There it be. Come cut the string, come. Okay, it looks like this is the end. This area. Run, run, run away. Whoa! What the hell? More this. I think maybe it did that because I, I went too far. I mean, I, I guess I'll keep that in mind now, but damn. <laughs> yeah, maybe because you tried to run away. Yeah, okay, we 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 know what happened. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I want to tell you. Yeah. Sad, 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 sad. that one Head over here what, what in the hell more this yeah i got i got to switch this Maybe don't move. Oh, the audio died? I think the game died too. Oh, oh, there we go. Okay. It's back. So wait, I so I have to I have to follow wait. So I have to do the opposite of what he's telling me? So we're still we're still under don't listen to the voice rules. I don't think I can cut the white string. I think those are those are just traps. Yeah, might as well. What does he say? Don't move. Okay, so we keep moving. We move. Oh, hello. Alright, now he says come cut the string. So we don't want to cut the string. Okay, maybe I can cut it now? Okay. Now as he said, run, run, run away. Okay, so when he says, maybe when he says run, I can't move anymore.
Had a lot of problems with the random bodies falling when you played this. I didn't say Simon Says. I think what's interesting to me about this is how different this is from the final encounter in the first game. The, the final encounter in the first game played out a lot more like the, the, the ghost encounter in the library in this one. And this is like a very different concept altogether, which I think is really cool. Um, it just, it kind of sucks that it's... I don't think it's very clear about what it wants. Yeah, it would have it would have been really nice if they had cut the intro on retries. Sorry, fucko, I'm moving. Okay. Okay. Some something scared her, I guess. Yeah, she stumbled back and then More died. I didn't cut anything. You don't cut anything unless you push the button. I didn't push the button. So. It was either it was either the web spike or something behind it. But it knocked her down. Oh, you think it does that if you even approach it? Yeah, I don't, I, I, I don't, I don't like how much guesswork there is in figuring out how you're supposed to handle this. That makes it feel very trial and error. Okay, so I guess we'll just hang around over here for a while. Okay. Seem to be in the clear. Okay, now... Okay, now don't move. Ah, <laughs> okay. Okay. That makes a lot more sense. Boy, where's the last thread? There it is. Oh. Okay. I guess she's done being Yui. How sad, how sad. Go with her now. No, I don't think I will. How sad. Don't leave me. Together forever. Yes. Oh, there's a lot of cutting to do. There's a lot of cutting to do. I think I see where this is going. It's 
strings keep wrapping around my hand. Yeah, you know what to do. Yeah. Huh. Yui. Yui. Please. Please stop. I'm sorry. Couldn't stay with you forever. Even though you saved me. I'm sorry that I couldn't save you. I'm sorry that I couldn't say goodbye. I'm sorry, Yui. Yui! Please! Please stop it! I can't take this anymore! I don't know that she's gonna survive this. Yeah. <clears throat> Japanese mythology is thought an invisible red string of fate ties people together. Yeah, I've, I've heard that, I've seen that theme used in a lot of different stories. So in case you missed it, <laughs> Scissor man cut her left uh, her left hand off so she wouldn't be tied anymore. Sorry. I really wanted to be together forever. I'm so sorry. Goodbye. Goodbye, Yui. Notably, her left hand was the one she held hands with Yui while in, within the opening, the one she's been holding Yui's flash with, light with all game. So symbolic of her connection with her. Chaco, do you know triage? You're a bit of a wonder pup. Can you do something about her stump here? Let go of her hand? Yes, that's a yes. Mr. Kodawari's specialty is the severing of relationships. Oof. That was really good. Yeah. I feel like they had... I think, I, I feel like they had a, a more well-defined vision for this game than they did for the first one. Now I wonder what happens if you don't let go of her hand? I wonder. Maybe she dies and stays with Yui? That was really good, but I'm an idiot, so I don't know what the fuck just happened. So... So it turned out that... 
Yui. Okay. So Yui killed herself after her dog died, but not of her own volition. She was pushed to do that by the big the big spider god thing who wanted I guess the spider god just wants people to stay with it. Um and Haru wanted to find her. She wanted she wanted to track her down and bring her back even after discovering that she was probably dead. Um but that connection the connection that Haru had to Yui made her a lot more susceptible to being caught and killed by the spider god, too. So after, after she beat, after she stood up to the spider god and defeated it, she had to literally and symbolically sever her relationship with Yui to, to escape back to the land of the living. And I guess she couldn't do it herself, so she got the Scissor Man, Mr. Kotowari, to help her do it. And then Yui's... I guess Yui's final act was to help her get out of there. Giant Spider God thing is called Malice, apparently. That makes sense. The story in the first game also has pretty strong implications. I like the story in the first game. I, I do like I do like the the story in the first game of the the corrupt mountain spirit that's luring people to it through tragedy. But I I feel like I feel like this one is just like that one is good and this one is great. Is how I would put it. Uh cuz I I feel like this one like the the symbolism is stronger, the story is stronger, it has like much much stronger emotional beats. Makes sense. It's interesting. We had more functioning brain cells. You is also trapped due to that connection, so they're both screwed. <clears throat> yeah, I guess at that point it was impossible for both of them to escape. One of them was going to end up lost, regardless. Did she lose her whole... God, I think she lost her whole damn arm. Red leash. Head off to bed, Mr. Alien. Good night. I'm glad you're able to see the conclusion of this. Another, another little thing about this game, and I guess this series of games, they're not afraid to really linger on scenes, really, really, really make you ponder them. Dumbass was expecting a spider eye hand to take the flower. Summer is ending. I moved and I made a new friend. I wonder if I'll be able to remember this summer years from now. I wonder what the future will be like. Life is very scary. No kidding. Yes, we'll save our clear data. 
uh, there's some additional content in the nearby town. You can meet up with the old protagonist. That's cool. I don't be able to remember the summer years from now. Your arm's off. So yeah. Oh my god. So yeah. No arm. She's got. She's got. It looks like she's got her flashlight. Uh, hang like strapped to her chest. Oh, you take a puppy along. With he is a brown puppy that Yui owned. His name is Chaco. He's really small, but he's brave and protected me. I'm not sure she can forget this summer, except maybe in the suppressing traumatic memories way. Staying the dog with you prevents you from being kidnapped by Mr. Yomawari. What's up, Newhauser? Good to see you. So, all right. So I was I was wrong actually. There are there are non-essential locations that you can go to, like the pond. We ne we never went to the pond. It also seems like there's some stuff we missed. Like, um, we never finished the connection on the, on the path here. I don't know if the observatory is like the dark place or if there's something else up here that we missed. There might be something down here off the train tracks. I didn't, I didn't visit the shrine out here in the field. I didn't explore the area around the library or, or the back roads uh, past the store. There might be something out this road this way. And yeah, I, I basically just did like a straight shot through the nearby town as well. So, I mean, you can kind of tell from the treasures. We got all the key items, but like, dude, I missed a ton. I missed over half the collection. I missed a ton of shit in this game. I didn't even, I didn't even find all the usable items. There's three more usable items somewhere in this game. So this is a big ass game. I was honestly kind of surprised we finished it in two nights. I was totally expecting three. But I guess the thing about it is the, the main story is a little bit longer. Um, but there's just a lot more to find in it. There's a whole, it's <laughs> all right. You never use them anyway. It's true. It's true. Yeah. I never tried the paper airplanes or the fireflies. Yeah. Yeah. This was great. This was absolutely great. I, I would say this is an improvement over the first game in every way. I really like the first game. I think this one's like a masterpiece. I think this, this game is incredibly good. So. We're gonna have to do the third game at some point. I don't know when. I I can't I can't say when, but I can't I can't leave it here when there is a third game to be played. So, but I do believe that's gonna do it for tonight, and I do believe that's gonna do it for uh, this game as well. Um, tomorrow, actually, let me get out of this, and I want to see something. Let me pop out of here. I want to check something real quick. Um, let's see here. Hmm. Okay. There's a typo between this and something else. Yeah, something else was Witch's House. That's what we're doing on Halloween night. But we've got one extra night. Turns out we've got one extra night tomorrow. Or tonight, technically, since it's afternoon. So here's what I'm thinking. Here's what I'm thinking. Um... 
think we can do if you're done done then the friend Hara makes in the journals of protagonist game one. Oh, cool nice i think tomorrow we can do either uh pony island or among the sleep i'm not sure which though Yeah, I feel like people are going to be pretty split on these. Hmm. Hmm. All right, I'm going to ruminate on this. I'm going, I'm going to sleep on it. I will think about it, and I will let you all know tomorrow which one it's going to be. Quick poll, charge terrors, as the person sitting on a mountain of them. <laughs> What is Among the Sleep about? I've seen Pony Island. Well, let me show you. Actually, let me, let me show you all what, what it is that we're talking about. Um. <laughs> there we go. So Among the Sleep uh, 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 is a game where you play as a small child trapped in a weird nightmare where you go looking for your mom. Uh, it's a first person, it's first person horror game where you play as a, a toddler. Yeah, you play as a two year old child um, and you're trying to find mommy and <laughs> I don't need to tell you shit goes wrong. <laughs> Things get weird. <clears throat> so this is one possibility. I played both. I definitely say Pony Island is the better game. Okay, so here's the here's the other thing. Um, I a long time ago, I watched a playthrough of Among the Sleep. Uh, so I do I do know what the story is in this game. I do remember that. I remember where it goes. I don't remember all the gameplay. I don't remember everything you do in it. Um. But yeah, I remember the bulk of the story. Pony Island, I don't actually know anything about. Pony Island would be completely blind. So I guess I might as well show you that as well. Pony Island is 99 cents right now. <laughs> Pony Island is a suspense puzzle game in disguise. You're in limbo, trapped in a malevolent and malfunctioning arcade machine designed by the devil himself. It's not a game about ponies. You lie, Eva. Lie. It's a Daniel Mullins game. Uh, same guy who made The Hex and... Uh, why does the name escape me? Why does the name escape me? They're ponies. It's an island. What's the name of that other game you made? Why am I stupid? I can just click on this. Inscript, oh my God, yes. The dude who made Inscript, yeah, thank you. I am stupid, that's right. Yeah, he's made three games, Pony Island, The Hex, and Inscription. I played The Hex and Inscription. Did I, I didn't, I didn't stream The Hex, did I? I just played that on my own time. I, scre I streamed Inscription back when it came out. I've never done Pony Island. So. The hex is really good. I love the hex. Um, I think I think Inscription is like the better game in terms of gameplay, but I I, I like the story in the hex a lot. I really like the story in the hex. I think it's super clever. So I'll be interested to see where Pony Island falls in between them. Um. I think my inclination is to do Pony Island. I've been wanting to do this one for a while, um, and I feel like something weird and surprising. Among the Sleep is good, but I, I feel like it's a more straightforward first-person horror game. Whereas this, I really don't know what to expect from this. So, are y'all cool with Pony Island tomorrow night? Does that sound acceptable? 
Doesn't mean we're never going to do Among the Sleep. I'm just saying Pony Island tomorrow. Ponies. Ponies. Manic will tolerate this. That's big of you. I appreciate that. Sure, sure. Okay, cool. All right. Presumably, presumably the final schedule shakeup that's going to happen for Spooktober because it's literally the penultimate game we're going to play. <laughs> Pony Island. Porny Island. Hello. Wish I could stream that. Oh, I've just been waiting to unleash his inner brody. <laughs> yes, indeed. All right, so that's the plan. Pony Island tomorrow night. I'm off on Sunday. And then Monday, Halloween night, we do um, The Witch's House. And that's, that's Spooktober, folks. That'll be Spooktober in the bag. Oh, boy. Anyway, I'm going to go find somebody to raid. Let's see who's do. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right, I can't, I, okay. I can't, I can't help. I can't help but send y'all to somebody playing Faith and Mary Ellen Katz is playing Faith. I like Mary Ellen Katz too. Good night, nice, nice place to wind up. Oh, <laughs> she's in chapter three as well. So we'll see how she fares against, against Gary and his minions. Yes, Mary is great people. Isn't all right, gang. Well, thank you so much for coming out. Thank you for joining me for the second night of Yomawari. I love these games so much. I really, really do. And this one, this one just hit all the notes for me. I really, I, I really think Midnight Shadows is a fantastic, definitely one of the best horror games I've played. Um, but yeah, I'm glad you're here for it. I'm glad you joined me for it. And hopefully... I will see you tomorrow night for Pony Island. Oh, boy. But until then, as always, y'all take care. Bye, everybody.